Question number 106. Mycorrhiza is symbiotic association between fungi and roots of higher plants. In which roots? So mycorrhiza as you know it's a symbiotic association between roots of higher plants means roots of gymnosperms and angiosperms and fungi. So in this roots where the root cap? No mycorrhizal roots don't have root cap as roots don't have to penetrate deeply in the soil. They bear enormous root hair? No. They enhance the supply of water, nitrogen, phosphorus and sulfur to fungi? No. Plants do not enhance the supply of minerals. It's the fungi which enhance the supply of minerals and water to the plants. So this is not correct. They provide shelter and nourishment to the fungal partner. Yes, the roots, they provide shelter and nourishment to the fungal partner. As plants are photosynthetic, they can provide nourishment to the fungal partner. So the correct option for the given question is option number 4. Let's move to the next question. Question number 107. Which of the following is correct about viruses? In six kingdom classification system, viruses are placed in kingdom Archaebacteria. No. Carl Woos, who proposed six kingdom classification system, placed Archaebacteria in a separate kingdom called Kingdom Archaebacteria. So they were Archaebacteria, not the viruses. So this is incorrect. Third statement, they are non-living as they do not have any biomolecule. No, they have genetic material, so they have biomolecules. So this is also incorrect. They perform aerobic respiration only inside the living cells. No, they lack respiratory enzymes. They cannot perform aerobic respiration. Now, the remaining option is option 2. They can be killed by autoclaving and UV rays. Yes, viruses can be killed by autoclaving and UV rays. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 2. Let's move to the next question. Question number 108. Who demonstrated the extract of infected plants of tobacco could cause infection in healthy plants and call this fluid as contagium vivum fluidum? W. M. Stanley. He was the first person who first time crystallized the proteins of virus. So, this option is ruled out. Avanovsky, he discovered the virus. So, this is also ruled out. Pasteur named the virus. So, this is also ruled out. M. W. Bejanik, yes, he was the man who demonstrated that the extract of infected plants can cause infection in healthy plants also. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 3. Let's move to the next question. Question number 109. The outer protein coat of viruses is called capsid, which is made up of many capsomeos. So, this option is ruled out. Envelope is seen in some of the viruses, not in all the viruses. Glycocalyx is seen in bacteria. So, the correct option for the given question is option number 2. Let's move to the next question. Question number 110. Virus infecting the plants usually have the genetic material which is single stranded RNA such as TMV. They have SSRNA. So the correct option for the given question is option number 1. Let's move to the next question. 